Let's begin the properties of ratio of areas of two triangles. Look at the figure. Here, we have two triangles, triangle ABC and triangle PQR. Area of triangle ABC is equal to half into base into height is equal to half into BC into AE. Area of triangle PQR is equal to half into base into height is equal to half into QR into PT. Therefore, area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle PQR is equal to half into BC into AE upon half into QR into PT is equal to BC into AE upon QR into PT. Hence, the ratio of the areas of two triangles is equal to the ratio of the product of their bases and corresponding heights. If area of triangle 1 is A1 and area of triangle 2 is A2, then this property can be expressed symbolically as A1 upon A2 is equal to B1 into H1 upon B2 into H2, where B1 and B2 are the bases, H1 and H2 are the heights of the respective triangles. For triangles with common base, look at the figure. Triangle XYW and triangle YZW have a common base WY. Therefore, area of triangle XYW upon area of triangle YZW is equal to XW into WY upon ZU into WY is equal to XY upon ZU. Hence, the ratio of the triangles with same base is equal to the ratio of their corresponding heights. Therefore, if B1 is equal to B2, then A1 upon A2 is equal to H1 upon H2. For triangles with common height, look at the figure. Triangle PQT and triangle PQS have same height PR. Therefore, Area of triangle PQT upon area of triangle PQS is equal to TQ into PR upon QS into PR is equal to TQ upon QS. Hence, the ratio of the triangles with same height is equal to the ratio of their corresponding bases. Therefore, if H1 is equal to H2, then A1 upon A2 is equal to B1 upon B2. Note, the bases TQ and QS are collinear and triangle PQT and triangle PQS have a common vertex P. Such triangles always have a common height. For triangles with common base and equal height, look at the figure. Segment MN is parallel to segment LK. You know that Triangles that lie between two parallel lines have equal heights. Let area of triangle MLK is equal to A1 and area of triangle NLK is equal to A2. Therefore, area of triangle MLK upon area of triangle NLK is equal to LK upon LK. Here, A1 upon A2 is equal to 1 upon 1. Therefore, A1 is equal to A2. Hence, the triangles with common or equal bases and equal heights are equal in areas. Think it over. Look at the figure. Which are the triangles with common base MN? In the figure, triangle KMN and triangle LMN have the common base MN. Now let's find the ratio of areas of these triangles. Here, segment MN is parallel to segment LK. You know that the triangles that lie between two parallel lines have equal heights. Let area of triangle KMN is equal to A1 and area of triangle LMN is equal to A2. Therefore, area of triangle KMN upon area of triangle LMN is equal to MN upon MN. Therefore, A1 upon A2 is equal to 1 upon 1. 
Let's look at few examples. Example 1. In the figure, it is given that EF is equal to 15, PF is equal to 10, points EPF are collinear, and then find the values of the following ratios of areas of triangles. Solution. Before we find the values of the ratios of areas of triangles, we need to find out the measure of segment EP. EF is equal to EP plus PF as points EPF are collinear. Therefore, 15 is equal to EP plus 10. Therefore, 15 minus 10 is equal to EP. Therefore, EP is equal to 5. Number 1. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle DEF upon area of triangle DPF. Area of triangle DEF upon area of triangle DPF is equal to EF upon PF as they are the triangles having equal height. Therefore, 15 upon 10 is equal to 3 upon 2. Number 2. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle DEP upon area of triangle DEF. Area of triangle DEP upon area of triangle DEF is equal to EP upon EF as they are the triangles having equal height. Therefore, 5 upon 15 is equal to 1 upon 3. Number 3. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle DEP upon area of triangle DPF. Area of triangle DEP upon area of triangle DPF is equal to PE upon PF as they are the triangles having equal height. Therefore, 5 upon 10 is equal to 1 upon 2. Example 2. The ratio of the areas of two triangles with equal heights is 3 is to 2. The base of the larger triangle is 18 centimeters. Find the corresponding base of the similar triangle. Solution. Let A1 and A2 be the areas of the larger and smaller triangle respectively. It is given that A1 upon A2 is equal to 3 upon 2. Let the corresponding bases be B1 and B2 respectively. Therefore, A1 upon A2 is equal to B1 upon B2 as they are the triangles of equal heights. Therefore, 3 upon 2 is equal to 18 upon B2. Therefore, B2 is equal to 18 into 2 upon 3. Therefore, B2 is equal to 12. Thus, the base of the smaller triangle is 12 centimeters. Example 3. Draw a pair of triangles that are equal in their areas. Solution. This is an open-ended question. Many figures satisfying the condition can be drawn. Here are a few such pairs. Now let's solve exercise 1.1. 1 .1. Question 1. In the figure, segment SP is perpendicular to side YK and segment YT is perpendicular to segment SK. If SP is equal to 6, YK is equal to 13, YT is equal to 5 and TK is equal to 12, then find area of triangle SYK is to area of triangle YTK. Solution Area of triangle SYK is equal to 1 upon 2 into YK into SP is equal to 1 upon 2 into 13 into 6. Therefore, area of triangle SYK is equal to 39. Area of triangle YTK is equal to 1 upon 2 into TK into YT is equal to 1 upon 2 into 5 into 12. Therefore, area of triangle YTK is equal to 30. Thus, area of triangle SYK upon area of triangle YTK is equal to 39 upon 30. By simplifying it further, we get 13 upon 10. Thus, 
area of triangle SYK is to area of triangle YTK is equal to 13 is to 10. Question 2. In the figure, RP is to PK is equal to 3 is to 2. Then, find the values of the following. It is given RP upon PK is equal to 3 upon 2. Solution. Now, extend side RK. Draw a perpendicular from T to side RK meeting at point Q. Thus, TQ is perpendicular to RK. Number 1. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle TRP upon area of triangle TPK. Area of triangle TRP upon area of triangle TPK is equal to PR upon PK is equal to 3 upon 2 as they are the triangles with equal height. Thus, ratio of areas of triangles is TRP and TPK is 3 is to 2. Number 2. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle TRK upon area of triangle TPK. Area of triangle TRK upon area of triangle TPK is equal to RK upon PK as they are the triangles with equal height. Therefore, RP plus PK upon PK is equal to 3 plus 2 upon 2 is equal to 5 upon 2. Thus, ratio of areas of triangles is TRK and TPK is 5 is to 2. Number 3. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle TRP upon area of triangle TRK. Area of triangle TRP upon area of triangle TRK is equal to RP upon RK as they are the triangles with equal height. Therefore, RP upon RP plus PK is equal to 3 upon 3 plus 2 is equal to 3 upon 5. Thus, ratio of areas of triangle TRP and TRK is 3 is to 5. Question 3. The ratio of the areas of two triangles with the common base is 6 is to 5. Height of the larger triangle is 9 centimeters. Then find the corresponding height of the smaller triangle. Solution. Let A1 and A2 be the areas of the larger and smaller triangle respectively. It is given that A1 upon A2 is equal to 6 upon 5. Let the corresponding heights be H1 and H2 respectively. Therefore, A1 upon A2 is equal to H1 upon H2 as they are the triangles of equal base. Therefore, 6 upon 5 is equal to 9 upon H2. Therefore, H2 is equal to 9 into 5 upon 6. Therefore, H2 is equal to 7.5. Thus, the corresponding height of the smaller triangle is 7.5 centimeters. Question 4. In the figure, segment ST is parallel to side QR. Find the following ratios. Solution. It is given that segment ST is parallel to side QR as parallel lines on the same base are perpendicular to the base. ST is perpendicular to PS and QR is perpendicular to PQ. Number 1. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle PST upon area of triangle QST. Area of triangle PST upon area of triangle QST is equal to PS upon QS as they are the triangles with common height ST. Number 2. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle PST upon area of triangle RST. Area of triangle PST upon area of triangle RST is equal to PT upon RT as they are the triangles with common height ST. 
Number 3. Now let's find the ratio of area of triangle QST upon area of triangle RST. Area of triangle QST upon area of triangle RST is equal to ST upon ST as they are the triangles on the same base ST.